Today we're taking a look at charts, but not just the charts, we're looking at modifying some of the elements that we find in our charts. So here we have our data, and you can see at the bottom we have chart match A, chart match B, and chart match C. And you can see the variety of charts that have actually been used for this. So let's go to chart match A, and I'm just going to click on the very first chart. Now, you'll see in your ribbon on top, we've got tabs that have come up, our chart design and our chart format. So we want to stick to the chart design, go all the way over to the left of the chart layouts. And here we have add chart element. Now, you can see with each one of these, I have different options. So I can change things like the chart title, which is currently above the chart. I can take that off. I can center that. I can change the labels as well in terms of where they are going to be. Uh, the data labels, I can add a legend, I can throw in grid lines, but this is where I can change all of these items. Alternatively, I mean, I can click on some of these and go and edit that as well. So let's look at another chart, same story. You will, however, see that some of them, based on the type of chart, some things will be grayed out because it doesn't apply. So let's go to chart match B, click there and add chart element you'll see the same happen so it only allows us to deal with our legend our data labels and our chart title this one again chart elements and you'll see how many options you have there so you can see it varies from chart to chart but guys this is how and where we can go to actually modify um, and change our chart elements